here, Megan McNeil, personal brand strategist. Now, I want to tell you about this really cool feature that LinkedIn has called Featured. So when you go onto your profile and you just scroll down just slightly below the about section, you've got this area here called Featured. And this is really quite cool because it's like pinning things to the top of your um, profile so that when people land on it, it's the first thing that they see and people are really visual. So the more pictures you have on there and eye-catching things that people are actually going to look at, the better. Um, I have a little introduction there um, and then I've got one of my um, blog post there I think as well now let's have a look at everything I have in here so when you click and see all you can just scroll through them all just up and down like that you can have as many in here as you want um, but when you want to add something you click here and then it will give you this option. Is it a post? Is it an article, a link or media? So posts would be something that you've actually posted on LinkedIn already. Articles would be an article. So essentially a LinkedIn blog, same as what you put on your website, but on your, um, your LinkedIn, you would add that there. Links, so that might be to something external like your website or your podcast, or if you were um, a guest blog on something or a guest uh, podcast or a YouTube video perhaps. And then media would literally Literally just be that you were going to upload um, photos, documents, uh, presentations, just as it actually says, it's right there in front of you. Um, now what happens when you do this is it'll pull from what you already have. So these are the articles that I've written and I can just scroll through them until I see one that I want. So I might put up this one, uh, building a personal brand uh, on podcast, click feature and it's there. I don't want it to be a feature anymore. Remove from feature, done. Now, the other way you can edit these is if you go into the pane here, it, um, it lists everything that you've already got on your featured stuff. And it also allows you to move it up and down. So maybe I want that one to be at the front now. I've got a mixture here of articles that I've written on LinkedIn and I've also got my podcast and I've got my LinkedIn training, which they're external links. And if I want to... Uh, so for, for the external links, you can only edit or delete them. But for all the ones that are actually native to LinkedIn, you can just remove them directly here. Now, when you are editing and adding the links that are external, add as much information there as you can because all of this is search engine optimized. So you want to get the keywords in there that you think people might actually be looking for. So um, yeah, put your the two or three most important at the front and then load it up with a few other ones that you think people who are actually interested might come and have a look at. All right.